Laboratory. We're back here with Jessica Ivey, uh, a diet nutrition expert, always has a healthy modification on the, the foods we love. So tell folks what we're making today. So eggs are one of the most valuable resources in your kitchen and a must have for the ultimate egg holiday, Easter. Yeah. Yeah, so I love dyeing hard-boiled eggs with my kids, but we also enjoy them year-round as a convenient and easy-to-prepare high-quality protein. And the great thing about hard-boiled eggs mm -hmm. is they can be made in advance and they last for a full week in the fridge when stored in the shell. Okay, important to note there, All right? Yeah, so that's why I partnered with the Egg Nutrition Center to show you how to make a dill egg pasta salad to mm -hmm. use up all those dyed eggs. All right, let's do it. Yeah, so I've already hard-boiled my eggs. I think most people know how to do that. Yeah. So now we're gonna mix up the dressing. All right. I'm starting with a fourth cup of extra virgin olive oil and adding two tablespoons of white wine vinegar and a little bit of Dijon mustard. And then we'll add just a half a teaspoon of sugar and some salt and pepper. So I'm gonna whisk this up until it's nice and blended. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna add some vegetables and herbs. I yeah, love it, artichokes here. Yes, canned artichoke hearts, super easy. You just drain, drain them. Some now what are the health onion. benefits of artichokes, by the way? They're rich in potassium, fiber, and vitamin C, so lots of good stuff in there. And then I've got some dill and parsley, and I just love the fresh spring flavor that that's gonna oh, add. Yes, yes. Then we've got some cooked whole wheat rotini pasta. So I just love how versatile this recipe is. You can really use whatever ingredients you have on hand. So you could use any shape of pasta, it doesn't have to be rotini. Trade out the parsley and um, the parsley and dill for other fresh herbs like basil, or even use dried herbs in the dressing. Mm -hmm. And then you could switch out the vegetables too. So you could use um, leftover cooked asparagus and green peas. So really you can use up whatever ingredients you already have on hand in your fridge and pantry. I like the whole wheat pasta though, because you're, adding, you're, you're again adding more fiber, which we all need. That's right. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to add about half of the eggs here. So as a versatile source of high quality protein, eggs can help you to use up ingredients you have on hand and reduce food waste. So that can save you money on your grocery bill, which we all know is important right now. So I'm going to toss this all together. And we've learned you know, over the years, uh, you know, there used to be, I'm sure you're aware of, the, aware of those studies before, oh, eggs are bad for your cholesterol. And we found that not to be so true. And so mm -hmm. you don't have to, some people might say, well, I'm going to take the yolk out, only do the egg whites. You don't really have to, right? No, you're missing a lot of the nutrients mm -hmm. if you just eat the white because the yolk is full of good for you nutrients, including choline, which most of us are not getting enough of. It's really important for brain health, especially for infants and breastfeeding and pregnant women. So All I'm right, putting this on to a spinach bed for the salad. Now the yes. spinach, uh, tell us what's in that that's good for us. So the great thing about serving it on the spinach is that eggs can help you to better absorb the nutrients found in vegetables like vitamin E and carotenoids. So always looking for a way to get an extra dose of those veggies and it's great when you can add the eggs with it. Okay. So, so that's a spinach, is this a kale version over here? So this is, I just want to show you, this is an example. This is a fresh arugula and couscous salad. Okay, Another okay. example of how you can use eggs to build simple and balanced meals with ingredients you have on hand. So this salad uses arugula as a base, but you could use other salad greens like spinach, romaine, or spring mix. Mm -hmm. Then in place of the couscous, use leftover cooked rice, quinoa, or farro. Add fresh vegetables. This salad uses cucumber, but you could also use tomatoes or carrots or leftover cooked green beans. Add your hard boiled eggs for that source of high quality protein and use a dressing with staple ingredients like olive oil, lemon juice, and honey. So super simple to build those tasty and nourishing meals using eggs as a versatile source of protein. I love it. Just Ivy, thank you so much. Uh, save some of this for me because I'm going to eat some. I'm definitely going to dive into this. All right, we're going to take a break. We'll be back in just a moment.